Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between debit and credit in accounting. As per the double entry system of bookkeeping, each business transaction affects two sides of an account, that is debit and credit. While debit indicates the destination, credit implies the source of monetary benefit. For each debit or credit entry, there is always a corresponding and equal credit or debit entry. The debit and credit entries are made in the ledger accounts to record the changes in value because of business transactions. So, let's look into the basic differences between debit and credit in accounting in a tabular form. Difference number 1, debit is an entry that is passed when there is an increase in assets or decrease in liabilities and owner's equity. Whereas, credit is an entry that is passed when there is a decrease in assets or an increase in liabilities and owner's equity. An entry made in an account on the left side is the debit entry or debit. Whereas, when an entry made is on the right side of the account is credit entry or credit. Number 2, the act of recording entries on the left side is known as debiting the account. As against, the act of recording the entries on the credit side of the account is called crediting the account. Number 3, act of recording entry in debit is called debiting, and recording entry in credit is called crediting. Number 4. The value of an asset that is being debited has increased or the firm has purchased more of that asset. Whereas, the value of an asset that is being credited has decreased or the firm has disposed of a part or the entire asset. Number 5. Liabilities show decrease by amount debited, whereas liabilities show increase by amount credited. Number 6. Capital show decrease by amount debited, whereas capital shows increase by amount credited. Number 7. Income shows decrease by amount debited, whereas income shows increase by amount credited. Number 8. Expense shows increase by amount debited, whereas expense shows decrease by amount credited. And, difference number 9. Stock shows increase by amount debited, whereas stocks shows decrease by amount credited. Debit and credit are the two sides of the same coin. One must note that debit entries of each transaction must tally its credit entries. So, these are the differences between debit and credit in accounting. If this lecture was helpful, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.